I got the deck cleaned off. Had this nifty drill, the wire wheel, and I've got all cylinders, which I got out of the light. You can see got the tops of all the cylinders cleaned off, and I got the deck pretty well cleaned up. I'm gonna hit it with uh, there's a nylon with diamond particles. We're gonna clean it up. Interesting little tidbit. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it. Can you see top of that cylinder? Zero, four, zero. That's been bored 40 thousandths over. Zero, four, zero. I've got the head cleaned up. I've got the new uh, retainers and seals on it. Well, I'm running out of light here, but I've got to get this head back on. I've got the mating surface all clean. I've got the two dowels lining, which is weird that they're on the same side. I was hoping they'd be opposite, so it'd help twist, but uh, it's a Felpro blue gasket, so I don't need the shellac or the gasket coating. Um, all cylinders are down kind of right now, and I took some oil, poured it on top of each piston, and it took my hand and wiped all cylinder walls so that way kind of lubricates on the first fire up, it'll be lubricated. But I gotta get this head on, as you see, sunset, and I'm running out of light. And I'd rather not have to come back out here or cover this back up. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the head on and go from there. I don't know how much light I'm gonna have, but uh, yeah. I manhandled and got it up there by myself. Not a lot of fun. Okay, I've got the, I've got the head torqued down. It's three steps, uh, 55, 65 and 85. It's torqued down and double checked. I've got all the rockers. They're not set yet. I just got them, the push rods out of the way. They're all cleaned up and in their respective holes where they came out, they went right back in. I've got the valves adjusted. Um, you know, find top dead center of your piston. And I just started because of the way the cap rode, where my pickup was here, it was pointing at six, which is cylinder six. And I rotated the crankshaft, stuck this little bit of screwdriver down a spark plug and watched it do this. And I rotated it back and it brought it up. And as it started to go down, I went just a little bit more to get this screwdriver to get the top dead center on six while I'm on the compression stroke is what you gotta find. And I do believe the compression stroke is where your exhaust and your intake are closed because you're compressing. You're not gonna open up to let the intake go open and let the exhaust go out. So I checked, none of these lifters moved. None of these push rods moved. So I set to 23 foot pounds because it's 17 to 23. My torque wrench. We got an old school one. Old school Sears. But I got it. And then I just went from there in firing order to two, four, one five, three, and yeah. We got the valve adjusted, put some oil on top of the lifters here and uh, on top of the rocker arms, bolt it down, hook up a battery, and we should be good to go.